Hey, and welcome to More Post to Post. This is our second channel. We're going to rank some FIFA World Cup jerseys. It's going on right now as we're making this video. And I thought it would be a good opportunity to talk talk about soccer a little bit, even though it's not about soccer, it's about the jerseys and the kits that they're wearing or whatever you want to call them. Uh, but I split it into two videos. This video is going to be the home jerseys. It's kind of complicated a little bit because some countries decided we're going to use white as home. Some countries decided we're going to use dark at home. Some countries have dark for home and away. So you're going to actually see light and dark jerseys in this video. Uh, I don't know why they made it, made the decisions like they did, but uh, of the 32 teams here, there's going to be both white and dark. So they're, it's kind of mixed in, and the away video will be the exact same. Um, they'll be mixed too. Okay. So we're going to do home this time. I've ranked them uh, 32 to 1, my least favorite to favorite, and that's the order we're going to go in least favorite first. Sounds good. You ready to go? I'll just do color commentary. Yes, yeah, so you're the color guy here. All right. Okay, so we're going to start Sorry off the with... <laughs> with uh, my uh, least favorite <clears throat> jersey or kit. I think most a lot of people call them kits, but in North America we call them jerseys. Whatever. So my least favorite is Japan. Now okay. the reason I okay, I love the color. Blue is my favorite color. I like the white on on the shoulders, but it looks like a sweater vest, doesn't it? I guess so. I it's never. Like, I didn't think of that until you said it. And once I realized that, that's all I could see every time I looked at this. And because of that, I put it last. So if the sleeves had the same dotted arrangement, you'd, yep. you'd probably like it more. Oh, way more. Or if or if it was a solid color yep. in, the, in the center part. Yeah, definitely way more. Just even the pattern makes it look like a sweater vest. Yeah. Like a Christmas sweater vest or something. Yeah, even though it's blue, <laughs> I know. But, uh, yeah. yeah. All right, 31. Okay. Uh, uh, Egypt. Do you know these, like, are you cheating? Do you want to cheat and look up there? Or do you want me to ask you as kind of a trivia question as we go through? I'll these? try not to look up there, but I can't okay. guarantee that I won't but stray once in a did while. You think, did you think, would you, would you have been able to guess that that was Egypt? No idea. Okay. I, I would have had no clue. And see, that that's kind of why it's ranked a bit low. Yeah. It's pretty generic. I mean, you've got a, a black collar and a black sleeve mm -hmm. part. And the rest just kind of looks like a generic Adidas shirt. I yeah. mean, on the Trailer Park Boys. Ricky used to wear Adidas Adidas shirt like that with the stripes going down mm -hmm. like that in one of the earlier seasons, and that's kind of what it reminded me of. It is, I don't know. Uh, number 30. Can't tell you who it is. Okay. Oh, is there a flag down there? Uh, I don't think so. I think that's no. the best. Anyway, so if you can't guess, look up top, and then okay. you, can, you can learn. But this is... Uh, Tunisia. Tunisia. So yeah. this is... Is this a country in Africa? Yes, it is. It's nor northern Africa. It's on the Mediterranean. Okay. Um, yeah, near Morocco, Algeria. It, it, okay. Yeah. It's um, it's just white. It's I don't know. It's it's kind of like it's basically the last one except for it, you know, just with different color collar and, and sleeve. But mm -hmm. it's got a bit of stuff on the side, which is interesting. But uh, I'm not a just I'm not a big fan of white in general. White hockey jerseys. We talk a lot of hockey on our other channel. Not a big fan of white white jerseys in general. So this is just a personal preference. And I should have said that at the beginning. Oh yeah, this is not this is scientific complete, or anything. This is personal and subjective. You have your own list, and by all means, please leave it in the comment section. I'd actually love to, to go down and read your rankings, but there's no reason to get upset with my personal rankings. It's a personal list. So uh, just calm down if you're starting to get a little upset. Mm -hmm. um, just enjoy the process. And then... and when you did the rankings, in, for you, and these are your rankings, you didn't look at the country either. You just looked at the jersey. Yeah, exactly. So we're not saying that... Tunisia is our 30, 30th favorite country. Yeah, it has nothing to do with the country. Nothing to do with and, and you'll see that once I do the away video yeah. too, because the countries are all different spots. Mm -hmm. um, we're Canadian, so we have we don't have a horse in this race. Even though I'm wearing a Germany shirt from the previous FIFA World Cup in 2014, um, I got this for two dollars and eighty-eight cents, and that's the only reason I got it. Like I'm, I'm not rooting for Germany. I'm not rooting for anyone. I don't even really <laughs> like the sport that much. No offense, but yeah. all right, I do. Uh, yes, you do. I do. 29. Hmm. Can't tell you who right, it is. This is Iran. Uh, it's, again, pretty generic. It's just, you can see the subtle striping a little bit, but it's yep. just in general, it's just a little bit too plain for me, so that's why I have it there. Mm -hmm. 28. One um, thing, I, I'll, I'll just point at this, as you get to this, we've now seen the third different manufacturer. We've seen a couple of Adidas and Nike, and we had that other one, I forget the name of it already, but... Yeah, there's there's all kinds of... There. Unlike the league, where the NHL says, okay, every team's going to have Adidas, yeah. or every team's going to have Reebok. Here, each country has its own sponsorship and its own manufacturer that it chooses to make its jerseys, and I think that's cool. It's kind of like NASCAR, too. They Some are Camaros, and some are whatever. Yeah. Like yours, so. Yeah. Um, I assume you might be able to guess this one. I can because 
they call this the three lions. Yeah. And it, and it is England. Yeah. So, uh, again, nothing against the country. It's just the fact that it's just white is boring to me. It's just plain. Um, I assume this decision was made on a tradition basis. They've probably always oh, worn white so. or something like that. And that's totally fine. It's just it's just white for me. So, mm -hmm. 27. Oh, yeah. Well, at least it has the country name on yeah, it. Yeah, you can kind of cheat a little bit. Good, so, this yeah. is South Korea. <laughs> uh, and it's just red. Yeah. I like red more than white. That's the only reason this is above England. Um, that's the only reason. It's just red. I mean, okay. 26. I... It's not a great picture, obviously. But it isn't. Uh, this yeah. is Saudi Arabia. Okay. Uh, again, just white. I like the green collar, but just white. All right. 25. Uh, New Balance. Yeah, another mm. another brand. And this is... Uh, this is Panama. I can see now. It's Panama. Yeah, so I almost just pure red. Got a little bit of white there on the shoulders. And also the collar is completely different. New, yeah. like, different brand of, of... Almost a little V-neck going yeah, on. Yeah, kind there. of. Yeah. And then also like a, almost like a checkerboard pattern in the red itself. So Yeah. Uh, I like that better. All right. Okay. 24. I wouldn't know. Uh, but but it, I, I see now from the the file name what it is. Yeah, but, uh, Serbia. So uh, again, a Puma, a different brand. Another yeah, again. another different brand. Uh, like the whites, the white mm -hmm. uh, shoulder area. And for all I know, this is the national crest or the crest on the flag or something. Yeah, for I'm sure. not familiar. Some of the the Balkan countries that are fairly new, the last twenty twenty five years, I must confess, I haven't committed to memory. <laughs> yeah. Croatia, Kosovo, Serbia, Montenegro, so Slovenia. Yeah. Uh, I have no idea what their flags look like, and that's just I haven't been into flags lately. So oh. my apologies. We'll have to get you into flags. We'll have to get me into flags. <laughs> uh, ranked twenty third is that is Portugal. Well done. That is Portugal. Well done. Yes. Yeah. Uh, I thought it was really cool how they incorporated the colors mm -hmm. in the in the line down in the back of the neck. Oh yeah. Obviously, we're not going to be able to see this when somebody's wearing that. No. So unless it goes on the outside, you can see. The unless back, the person but... wearing that scores a goal and. Tears it I off like so, they yeah. often do but I, I really, as he I, goes sliding on his knees into the corner. I really like that. I thought it was a good touch. Yeah, it was a nice touch. There, so. yeah. And you can see a little bit of pattern or something in the arms. But mm. it's in general, it's just it's just mainly red. Okay. 22. I can't even see it well enough to... It's pretty bad. Yeah. It's uh, Morocco. Oh, okay. Uh, I do like the different colored things on the shoulder area. And it's not just a, a, a line down. It kind of comes almost in a wave a little mm -hmm. bit. So I yeah. do like that. But the majority of it is white. So All right. not really my favorite. 21. It's Denmark. Oh, okay. Uh, Couldn't tell from the uh, from the crest. Again, a different brand of, of, of jersey here. Yeah. Or manufacturer. And it's got the, some arrows on yeah. the shoulder point. Yeah, chevrons, really. Yeah, kind of. Yeah. And uh, so this is the first time we've seen that. I thought that was a little bit unique, uh -huh. so that's why I ranked it where it is. All right. Number 20. Ah. I didn't know. Well, no, I do know. If I see, I can see the eagle. Or the, you uh, know, the, the bird in the crest. Yeah. And that's uh, on the so, German flag. Germany. Too, so. Yep. Uh, some really unique designs here on it. Uh, again, not a big fan of the white, but uh, yeah. th the fact that they did put this, whatever it is, unique on there. Mm -hmm. um, I did like that. Definitely unique. Yeah. Number 19. Wow. I, I can see the, the. Is it a lion or tiger? Yeah. Or, uh, that's interesting. Yeah. yeah they put that big in there. Cat. Pretty cool. Yeah. Yeah. I. I wouldn't recognize the country, but... Uh, it's interesting that Puma also made this. I wonder if they if, if they got Puma to make the shirt because oh, of there the you go. relationship of... Senegal, you've done well. Yeah, yeah. so uh, it, it's it's a cool jersey. Again, I don't really like white, but the fact that they put that whole logo of the lion in, in there, the yeah. tiger, uh, pretty cool. Yeah. Well done. Senegal's in West Africa. Uh, 18. Oh, that crest looks familiar. Yeah, it's uh, Poland. Oh, is it? Okay, I was I was thinking Eastern Europe, Czechoslovakia, something like that. But, yeah. Uh, right. Uh, or Czechoslovakia doesn't exist anymore. I, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, it's split you know kind I mean. of just subtly, halfway down with the um, white to gray mm -hmm. kind of things. I thought that was unique. So, yeah. and the logo itself seemed to be a little bit bigger on on theirs than a lot of them. So yeah, a little uh, easier to see. Yeah, I like that. So. Number seventeen. This is probably gonna be pretty easy. Mm, I think it looks a lot like uh, Sweden. Yeah, 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 definitely Sweden. The colors are there. Love, I'm used to seeing the three crowns, you know. Yeah, I uh, yeah. love blue and yellow together. Looks really and, good. And uh, they got a little, little design on the side, so I like that. Yeah. Sixteen. 
Brazil. Brazil, uh, another, obvious, another right? easy one. I mean, yeah. it says Brazil, but even if it didn't, you'd probably be able to guess. The color here is very iconic. Yeah, very iconic, and that's yeah. why I have it ranked 16th. Yeah, looks really sharp. Number 15. Oh. Kind of looks similar to some of the ones we've seen in the past. Looks like the logo of the International Space Station or something. <laughs> I can't uh, really tell where it's No, from. it's not. It's Costa Rica. Or Costa, oh, Costa really? Rica, however you want to pronounce yeah, it. Yeah, Costa Rica. Uh, so New Balance made this one, and I just liked the fact that it's... Uh, there's a name for the... It has a texture. Yeah. Almost, it's, uh, and it's not symmetrical. It kind of looks like it goes in weird ways. And it's just, yeah. I don't know, it's just different. It's so. geometric spirograph. Geometric. That's kind of. what I was looking for, yeah. Cool. 14. Oh, yeah. Should be able to guess this one based on the... I should, the shouldn't little I? little bit. I should, shouldn't I? It's Russia. Oh. Uh, okay. And, <laughs> and the color's red and white. Pretty... Uh, yeah, yeah. It's uh, surprising there's no blue in here. Mm-hmm. But... I do like this, the white that comes down a little bit close to the, the man boob area. I like that. <laughs> the pectoral region. There you go. Yeah. Number 13. <laughs> see if you can get this one. If you look closely, you should be able to get it. I see a kangaroo. There you go. So I'm going to say Australia. There you go. <laughs> there we go. Yeah. Uh, I just, like, I'm not a big fan of yellow, but the fact that they put this weird, I don't even know what it is, is it kind of looks like waves a little bit. Yeah. Um, and it also kind of looks like branches or something. I'm not exactly sure what yeah, it is, but it's unique, and uh, I appreciate that. So. Yeah. Number 12. Ooh. Now, I see a star at the top, often associated with uh, the east. I I don't know. Spain. I was wrong. Spain uh, is in the west of Europe. Probably could have guessed on the colors a little bit, but it's, yeah. it almost has... A bit of a Caribbean feel or something with the colors and designs coming down the side. It's like a mm -hmm. the Jamaican bobsledder team from Calgary. And <laughs> what year was that? 1988. 88. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So yeah, uh, that's the kind of feel. Like I did like it. Yeah. But uh, yeah. Yeah. Spain. Yeah. Number eleven. Oh. F P F. I thought you might recognize it from some of the games that you've watched so far, but it's Peru. Oh. Okay. And uh, first time we've seen a jersey like this with it coming down. It looks like he's wearing like a sash. Or, yeah, uh, looks like a sash. Good thing and a bad thing. Good that it's unique. Bad that it looks like he's wearing a sash because it just it's a little mm. distracting, I find. But I do, it's better than just pure white. So How do they keep those sashes from coming <laughs> off? <Yeah. laughs> Number 10. Oh, wow. I don't know. Nigeria. Oh, really? So completely different than anything that we've seen mm. so far. Yeah. Different colors on the arms and the, the chest area. Uh, the design is unique and, and pretty cool. So I, I actually really like this. Well done for them for doing that. Cool. Number nine. KSI. Severe underdog. Iceland? Iceland. Ah! Yeah. <laughs> yes. So this is a, a really almost pixely kind of design on the arms that is almost a gradient and fading into white on, mm -hmm. on the top of the shoulder. And I really like that. I also really like blue as well. So... This is why this is in the top ten. We're filming this about two thirds of the way through the the initial round robin in the first round. Yep. And I've been cheering for Iceland and will continue to for as long as they're around. And I have other teams I'd like to see do well, but Iceland is at the top of my list because it is such a great story. underdog. Yep. Underdog there story. You go. Yeah. Number eight. Uh, it has to be Switzerland. Yeah. <laughs> Pretty easy to guess yeah. this one. But at least there's a flag on here that's that's recognizable mm. which is great the pattern that they have in the shirt almost looks like a maze a little bit like a corn maze from above not maybe yeah. not a corn maze but a maze or something from above yeah uh pretty cool i i re actually really really like that and the fact that they have they stopped the white collar from going around um and went back to red and then back to white at the at the back mm -hmm. uh, i like that it kind of matches their flag a little bit yeah number seven <laughs> Can't tell from the crest. I don't. I wouldn't have been able to guess this. This is no. Colombia. Okay. Uh, it's it's obviously yellow, but it's it's almost like a, a matte yellow, kind of like a banana popsicle. Yeah. It, you know what I yeah. mean? Like it's not yellow, but it's just. Or those banana flavored marshmallows. Yeah, yeah, yeah. exactly. Yeah, yeah. So yeah. <laughs> I mean, it's unique. I really like that. Something like a sticky note, almost. Yeah, yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah, canary. And so it's kind of design coming down there too. I yeah. like that. That's so, nice. Yeah. Yeah. Number six. Oh. I wouldn't have been able to guess this. Belgium? This is Belgium. It is Belgium. Well I done. Did not peak. Uh, yeah, it's I, I yeah. It, again kind of got that 
sweater vest kind of feel to it with the pattern but it was just across there mm -hmm. and not the whole thing so i did like this design and this decision so well done belgium number five can't tell from the crest it's mexico oh really so <clears throat> i like the fact that they chose this green and then a different shade of green down here mm -hmm. um, i thought i i actually really really like this jersey a lot even though it's a majority of it is solid color um, it's a color that i really like so mm -hmm. thumbs up cool number four I can't tell, but I see that sun mm -hmm. uh, in the middle, but I can't tell from the crest what it is. You can cheat. I can cheat. Uruguay. Yeah, so okay. uh, the, the shade of this blue, it's almost like a sky a sky blue. Um, I really like that. I like the incorpor incorporation of that subtle sun or wood design or whatever it is. Mm -hmm. so, um, Very good. Up. Number three. It's pretty iconic, I think. So it's Argentina. Oh, uh, yes, I think of course it is. I think they've kind of used this design for a, for yeah, a while. I think they have, jerseys, yeah. But uh, yeah, could be wrong with that. But to me, that I, I would have got that right away. I don't know. And when I watch the games, and when when they show soccer, football, as some people call it, the cameras really way back, and the, the the players are on the field. You can't really see the detail of the jersey. Yeah, I yeah. And so I really don't pay much attention. Like I just know who's playing. Who and you don't really care about the jerseys. I really don't care. Anyway. I really so. don't care. Like I just know that okay, they're the light colored team, they're the dark colored team, except for the keeper who wears a different color, just yeah. So he can handle the ball. But um Yeah, I just I really yeah. I really like this. It's it's completely unique. Mm -hmm. Um the stripes coming down and, and the stripes actually have a pattern within them. Mm -hmm. uh, like a blocky pixelated kind of pattern. So yeah. Yeah, I like that. I, I love I that like shade it. of blue. So number two. Should be able to guess this based on the stripe in the back of the neck. Italy. France. Oh. <laughs> it, what I'm seeing, folks, you can't tell, but what I'm seeing is about this big yeah, on Neil's screen. It's, it's not small. the whole thing. I'm seeing a little tiny box about excuses, this size. Excuses, excuses. And I'm old. <laughs> there, I'll zoom it in for hey, you. Hey, that's better. Oh, of course, it's France. Yes, yes. I'm not sure what the, the rooster has to do with anything. I don't either. But I'm um, sure there's a reason for it. I do really like this. The dark blue in the yeah. middle and this kind of design along the arms and then the incorporation of the, the flag colors in yeah. the back of the neck. I, I actually love this a lot. It's pretty good. Cool. Number one. Well. What haven't we seen yet? Italy, wasn't it? Croatia. Oh. So. Yeah. Uh, I don't know where Italy is, but are they not in the... I honestly don't know <laughs> it's because we didn't do italy and they weren't the teams that i was going through i can't imagine italy's not in but really i don't know i'll have to look it up after this but ooh, ooh. anyways croatia number one have you did you see anything like this in the previous jerseys that we went through no I last time either. i saw that was at the indy 500 <laughs> yeah. yeah it's uh i just think it's 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 wonderful it's so it's like it's it's almost distracting you could almost use it as a tactic to, to distract the other person because it's not just squares they're made to look blurry yeah uh, i think that's cool i think uh yeah i think it's 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 ugly in a way i, I understand it but it's so i just it, think it's special i just think yeah it's, cool. it's very sporting yeah like yeah. it's got a real uh, competitive look to it I, I, yeah I, I like it too. so thumbs up for that Croatia. you're number, you're my number one uh like I, we said we're from Canada. I don't have any horse in this race. It has nothing to do with the countries. I'm just looking at the jerseys and ranking them. So, uh, cool. yeah, did you have fun? I did. I had fun. That was cool. Interesting. I learned a lot. Well, we'll do the away jerseys next. So if you could subscribe to this channel for to, so you can see this the upcoming away uh, video, that would be awesome. If you did like this video, please hit the like button. And thank you so much for watching it. We, we really appreciate it. We'll see you in the next one. Adios.